Here's a quick tutorial on how to hide the veins on your eyelids with concealer. I've already applied a light layer of foundation and when I apply my foundation, I normally use this brush here and I kind of just tap it over my eyelids at the end to make sure that my whole face is all the same color. That's a very light layer. Sometimes if I'm going to do a heavier eyeshadow look, I won't go in with concealer to cover my veins because I know that that plus the eyeshadow is going to take care of it. Let's say I'm doing a lighter look, a more natural look, or I don't even want to wear eyeshadow but I want the veins on my eyes covered. I'll take a concealer. Right now I'm using the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind and I'll apply just a bit on my lids. And then I like to take a flat concealer brush because it keeps the amount of coverage. And I'll just blend out over the whole eyelid. The reason I'm using a flat concealer brush and not a sponge or something a bit fluffier is because I definitely want everything covered very specifically and I have a lot of control over where the product goes if I have a flat brush like this. But also if I were to use something like a sponge, it would soak up the product as I apply it. Now that I've distributed the product all around my eyelids, I am going to use a sponge just to make sure everything is well blended. As you can see on this side, you can't see my veins anymore, maybe slightly. And if I wanted to fix that, I could just add a little more concealer. I'm going to finish it all off with a setting powder. I'm using the Hourglass Veil Setting Powder. This is my holy grail. I know a lot of people say the Laura Mercier setting powder is their holy grail, but this one is so finely milled, it makes everything look airbrushed and poreless. And what I always do before applying a setting powder anywhere is I will even it out on a flat surface. Give one more quick blend before setting to make sure that there are no creases or lines. And then with my powder puff, I'm just going to gently tap that into the product so that everything sets very clean. Blend out, no creasing, and set. In the meantime, I'm doing a light contour just with a powder. And now that my setting powder has had a second to set, I'm just going to wipe it all off. I'm using a Kabuki brush. This is one that I got from Sephora. I have quite a few of them linked on my LTK, many different options. And now I have the perfect base to apply a light eyeshadow.